the storage unit again to go pull some orders. And of course, look how much, look at the pouring down rain again. Y'all would think that we live in the uh, rainforest, but we really don't. We're gonna go here, see what we sold online. Let's go over some sales. Uh, the first sale right here, boop, boop, drill. $10 plus shipping, does not come with a battery. Keens, always good. These are kids' Keens, $15 plus shipping. Dumbo sold, $10 plus shipping. We had a Wii game sale. And uh, these, I think, sold for like $12 plus shipping, but they also bought a, was it the same person? I'm mm -hmm. assuming. Yep. Um, so this will be combined shipping like this. Boop, actually, you probably slice this one open, slide that one in. Wow, mine just blew. And then a Wii sold, had two remotes, one nunchuck, and two wheels. And that sold for $45 plus shipping. Wiis have gone down significantly in price. If that's one of those things you're like, hey, what was hot two years ago? And now it's not that hot? It's the Wii, correct? Mm -hmm. That and Dansko shoes. Remember, like, dance goes were, like, crazy finance uh, dance goes They'd be sold in 45 seconds. Julie, thank you so much for buying this guy. He's he's smiling at me. He's so cute. What movie is that from? He's smiling at me. Batman? The Joker? I don't know. Christmas Story about the duck. He's smiling. <sighs> anyway, so we, uh, that's about it. Oh, we did sell a Cleveland... Pitch and wedge right there, $10 plus shipping and a bat, $10 plus shipping. We have a pretty big sale going on in our store. Uh, just trying to move some stuff. We're just boop, 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 trying to move everything at the storage unit on a Sunday afternoon. And we are pulling some orders. So first, we're pulling one from Jackie and Jason. Thank you so much. You say you watch our other YouTube channel and this one. And we much appreciate the support. Remember, uh, we do have a eBay store link down below. If you want anything, we're giving deals. Talk about deals. Dance goes. They just don't sell that well for us. We liquidated most of our dance goes. So if you want some dance goes, we got a whole bunch. We sold some clogs over, they're actually over the house right now, $14.45. And then another pair we only sold for $12.50 plus shipping on those. We're just getting rid of them, right? Mm -hmm. Get them out of here. Uh, this right here is one of the most expensive Sony Handycams I've ever purchased before and sold. And the reason why, I think the reason why this one, because this is a little special. I'll show you what's special about it. So if you see this out there, obviously it looks like a Sony Handycam, right? You're like, oh, it's like a Sony Handycam. Everything on the outside is the same, but this is the difference. So you open this bad boy up, and right here, this one actually comes with like an old school memory chip, card. memory card. So you can have a memory card, and you can have the, um, the tape. This is one of the only ones that I've seen that has that. So I think that's what ups the price. We usually sell handy cams for about 100 and 105 bucks, 110 bucks. This one sold very quickly for 157 plus shipping. So if you see a handy cam out there with that memory card and they're asking maybe still 30 bucks for it, I wouldn't hesitate to buy it for 30 bucks because you know that's gonna sell for probably around 150. Some go as high as 190 depending if the batteries work. That one had bad batteries. So that just came with the Sony Handycam, the charger. The cool thing is, is if it doesn't come with a battery and you get a charger, you can still fully test the camera with the charger itself. Because it, it actually will, um, it does everything. You plug it up, it can do all the functions with the charger. So go ahead and go over some golf clubs. This right guy right here, look at this. This is handmade, vintage putter, wooden, unique. So for $20 plus shipping. So turbo heads. You're thinking, what in the world is a turbo head? It's just an off-brand, brand spanking new golf club, golf head. club head. Hmm. Remember where we got these? Mm -mm. Remember the, we bought out a golf store <gasps> oh, like yeah. three years ago before YouTube days. Did before, we video that? We, we didn't have a YouTube channel in. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we had one of our biggest hauls three years ago, and we're still making money three years. I know it's only 15 bucks, but... It's, we have just made so much money on that, but we didn't film it because we didn't have a YouTube channel. Then a U.S. Navy blue digital camo working parka Gore-Tex waterproof, $30 plus shipping. And we had some tools right here, some snap-on sockets. Got these for like probably a dollar or two, so for $54 plus shipping. And then we have a jacket. I could have swore you had the jacket out. I did. <sighs> did I put it in Z1? Oh no, she put the jacket in Z1. Uh, well, we had a King Louis Pro jacket sale for $15 plus shipping. A Hilti 
just the charger sold for $40.50. We had a pair of Kohans we just picked up at a state sale for $45 plus shipping. A burner right here. These are always good. Tailor-made burners usually sell very, very good for me. And that one sold for $54 plus shipping. You just picked up a pair of glasses called Bomber Tech. Yeah. Bomb Tech glasses. You picked them for $5. They sold for $18 international. Precious Moments. $30 plus shipping. Remember you picked it up for $2? Mm -hmm. Pair of Sperry's, $13 plus shipping. If you see more of these out there, all right, so if you see more of these, see what I did? See more. <laughs> uh, just remember, see more of these. if you see more of these putters, buy them. This one sold $47 plus shipping. It was in rough condition. Some of their uh, putters go for over $100, like easy peasy. And then a tailor-made right there went for $22. Just a tailor-made three wood fire sole. You've seen, like, you've seen one, you've seen about 500 of them. Dale Earn Wrong, Rusty Wallace. <laughs> Black shirt here. Uh, it's a tank top, so for ten dollars plus shipping. This guy, we had him listed so high for like thirty, forty, fifty. I don't, know, I forget. It was like fifty, sixty bucks, I think. Sweet. And then we finally sold him for twenty bucks international shipping. So what we're gonna do is try to find the uh, the jacket in Z1. Our sales are still good. We're still right on. We're actually up thirty three percent, and we haven't listed a whole bunch. And we really equate that still to listing and delisting stuff per day and changing things around, doing the pictures. A lot of things that we're doing is that we're taking the old pictures and, and putting new backgrounds on them and the items are selling. So that's why some of the stuff is over the house because we just listed it and or delisted it and listed it and it sold. So not too bad. Let's go see if we find this. Thing. 